after indoctrinating the people, I can now build a cult around Sora. Normally on Deity, the AI is given a 50% discount on the production cost of shrines, thereby allowing them to easily lock me out of a religion. Fortunately, we have deers and foxes to idolize. Because of Sora's insane obsession with furries, the first tenant idolized deers and foxes as they are descendants of Donald and Goofy. My next tenant is human sacrifices to revive Sora's mother. After Kingdom Hearts 1, Sora never heard back from his mother. It's presumed that she is dead. Out of grief, Sora performs human experiments to bring back his mother. So, I have to be obliged. Now, Sora didn't want to be known as the key bait leader who embarrassingly failed the mark of mastery exam. He wanted to be the living embodiment of God. So, I made him one under the third tenet. I also chose a tenet that gave people even more of a fur fetish, thereby putting deers and foxes on a pedestal. In a very miraculous clutch situation, I somehow managed to claim the last great profit from those power-hungry AIs. The great prophet proclaims the founding of the Church of Sora. I chose Pagodas to spread the joys of our dear Supreme Leader Sora while keeping the populace happy. In addition, I also chose Scribal Occupation to increase the property value of the church, hoping that one day we can deliberately crash the housing market. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you want more bizarre adventures, give this video a like and subscribe. Also, be sure to share this video as I love being called a hooligan for doing this.